like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face while you're sleeping. Google Earth can be a favorite toy of any professional procrastinator. It's hard to imagine how people found out the weird things that we will show you. Indeed, some of our fellow explorers are curious, but what motivated them? What intrigues them enough to move them and make them spend countless hours exploring the world? Well, today, we won't be able to answer that question, but we'll show you some of the strangest things found on Google Earth. From misleading pictures, to mythical civilizations, to an unbelievable sea monster, the things that we're going to see are simply amazing. We can find inspiration in nature's power, the most subtle of patient artists, or we can admire talented artists' work. Looking at Earth from space gives us a completely different perspective. Sure, we shouldn't abuse Google Earth and procrastinate, However, it can be inspiring to look at our planet as beautiful as it is, vulnerable, complex, and rich. All in all, we are sure you're going to enjoy it as much as we did. Come with us as we explore 10 strangest things found on Google Earth. Number 10, Bloody Lake. At the 10th spot, Macabre or Nasty brought you finding of a red blood lake in Iraq. Iraq was part of the Persian Empire and had a rich and complex history. For millennia, its territory was home to some of the most precious treasures of Persian architecture. However, today it has struggled too much against cruel tyranny and war. We can't see but brave people struggling to find new hope in the future, but most of its heritage lays in ruins now. The severe conflict has affected every corner of Iraq for almost two decades. Among the most affected places is Sadr City in Baghdad, suburb. Sadr City is a sad memory for American troops. They lived the Black Sunday in 2004, one of the most violent opposition they faced in Iraq. Google Earth shows a red lake outside the suburbs, which has led to speculation and disturbing theories. The local authorities have not offered any official explanations since the red lake was noticed for the first time in 2007. We'd prefer to think of that water's color comes from a pollution or a water treatment process than actual blood. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that will take just five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell and you get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it. It really works. Number 9. Oprah Maze For spot number 9, strange meets funny for a curious corn maze that Google Earth can spot. Quite recently, corn mazes became popular among farmers. Tourists love corn mazes, and agribusiness don't hate the extra money, so corn mazes started to spread worldwide as they grew in success. In 2004, an Arizona farmer built his corn maze with a peculiar inspiration. The maze was so big that it could easily be spotted through Google Earth. Furthermore, our good farmer isn't bad at all, drawing with his own cornfield tractor. The corn maze was actually an Oprah Winfrey portrait. To be honest, it looked amazing. Number 8. Lover's Island. At the 8th spot, we found a romantic hideaway. Croatia is a tourist magnet with its beautiful beaches and historical monuments. Yet today's remarkable site is superfluous but quite seductive. In 2009, Google Earthers discovered a relatively unknown island. You need to look at it from the sky to notice its unique shape. The small island was inhabited and wholly ignored until the world realized its heart-shaped outline. Although some people say that some authors knew about Lover's Island back in the 1800s, the internet disclosed Lover's Island alluring power. Number 7. Atlantis At the 7th spot, ancient civilization geeks found grids next to West African coast and went crazy soon after their discovery. As soon as they found image on Google Earth, myth lovers and geeks around the world thought they had discovered Atlantis' ruins. According to Plato's myth, Atlantis was a power civilization that had Athens against the ropes after conquering almost all of the world. Atlantis was a mythical civilization that suffered a devastating yet unexpected tragedy. Mysteriously, Atlantis lost the gods' favor. On a terrible and dark day, Atlantis sank into the sea. Although philosophy and ethics researchers claim that Atlantis is just an educational myth, many people believe the Atlantis story is authentic. The wildest dreamers out there can't stop thinking about the uncountable treasures hidden in under the ocean, somewhere between America and Africa. Yet, Google Earth engineers ruined all the fun when they explained that a digital artifact created the grid patterns. Arguably, sonar boats drew the grid where they were collecting mapping data. Number 6. Alien Magic? Conspiracy theorists are clever and imaginative sometimes. 
yet most of the time they are extremely lazy. At the sixth spot, we found an exceptional case of conspiracy laziness. A massive piece of artwork in the Eastern Sahara Desert, bordering the Red Sea, created an unexpected wave of wishful thinking and conspiracy theories. Desert Breath is an art installation by Danae Stratou, Alexandra Stratou, and Stella Constantines. It measures one million square feet, and according to the artist, its purpose is to celebrate the desert as a state of mind and a landscape of the mind. While extraordinary and intense, when visual explorers found it, many started to talk about aliens, lost civilizations, and even some ancient extraterrestrial magic. Can you believe it? Some would say that it isn't difficult to do to some research before going crazy. If they were using Google Earth, they just needed to use the web browser, right? Number 5. Camille Crater In the fifth spot of our list, we found strong evidence that we're luckier than we think. Google Earthers found a meteorite impact powerful enough to erase half of a middle-sized city. The Camille Crater occurred around 2,000 years ago, and it's so large that it could have been spotted from space. Researchers considered a small meteorite. We guess it's because it wasn't capable of obliterating an entire continent. The crater is 147 feet wide and 53 feet deep. Unlike other planets, Earth doesn't suffer this kind of impact frequently, fortunately for us. The good thing is, the meteorite and the crater provided insightful data for scientists who learned a lot about outer space thanks to the finding. If you ever want to get there, you'll need to travel to Egypt, specifically to the East Unwait Desert, very close to Sudan. Vincenzo de Michel, a former curator of the Museo Civico di Stronia Naturale di Milano, discovered it in 2008. Number 4. Fairy Bridge Unlike the Chinese Wall, which cannot be seen from space as an urban legend tells, there is a natural monument in China discovered through Google Earth. Zairen Bridge literally means Fairy Bridge in Mandarin. It's amongst the most prominent natural arches in the world. Jay Wilbur first found it using Google Earth in 2010. Wilbur is an active member of the Natural Arch and Bridge Society. After his finding, he organized an expedition to look at it closer. Ferry Bridge is over the Buliu River in the Guangxi province in China. Wilbur and his crew took a three-hour rafting trip to get there. Their goal was to measure the bridge. They found out that it is more than 108 feet longer than the previous biggest one in Utah, the United States. Unique and beautiful, don't you think? Number 3. Good Old Chief At the third spot, we introduce you to the Good Old Chief. It's harder to realize this image is anything different from a portrait of a Native American. The Badlands Guardian is an image of Clay Valley in Alberta, Canada. It looks like the Native Chief with a war bonnet. Oddly enough, the image isn't a result of human artwork or religious symbolism. Instead, the Badlands Guardian is nature's art in place. Now, get ready for today's best pick, Crabzilla. Wistable is a small coastal town in the United Kingdom. Famous for its oysters, it became a touristy spot a few years ago, after a local photographer spotted a giant crab close to Kent Harbour. The photograph became viral and it showed a crab that was more than 50 feet wide lurking in shallow water. As usual, many believe the picture was authentic. In contrast, others claimed it was nothing more than a weird sandbank, the photo edited to become a hoax. The shape of Crabzilla is the same as an edible crab, a common species in British water, yet it grows to an average of 5 inches. Do you believe Crabzilla is real? Number 1. Earth's Eye At the first spot today, we found an incredible natural phenomenon. It's a natural floating dam that has fascinated thousands of people with its mystery. In the Piranha Delta in Argentina, the natural floating dam is commonly confused with an island. The place got the moniker of The Eye, since it floats inside more of an enormous circular lake. Curiously enough, it moves as if it was actually watching its surroundings. The Piranha Delta region covers more than 5,400 square miles. It goes from Santa Fe and Rosario cities and gets as north as the Buenos Aires province. A horror filmmaker found the eye when he was looking for a spot to film his next movie. Yet, after spotting such a cool place, he decided to focus on a failed crowdfunding campaign to film a documentary about this discovery. Weird theories about the eye abound. Many talk about aliens, magic, and all sorts of rumors and hoaxes. However, scientists argue that the phenomenon, although impressive, 
is relatively easy to explain scientifically. Have you ever found anything strange on Google Earth? Why don't you let us know in a comment? Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.